Hello, how is everybody doing today? I got three path guides for you this week. One from Trap Team, two from Supercharge. We're going to start off with the one from Trap Team. We'll get to the last two path guides I have to do for Supercharge. Then I will be done. Did them all. In most cases, both paths, if they have a variant. If not, you only got one path. Most likely, my favorite. All right, let's take Spyro off. Anyone ever know? Let's check this out. His jump move superchargers look really really cool anyways it took me a very long time whoops time to, to get shine. spotlight but thanks to gamer family and air sicko this was one of my birthday presents the other being the sick sonic boom custom that air sicko did couldn't be happy with it. It's sitting on my nightstand, but let's get right into it. I will say, I did watch the path guides that one of Wisdom did. Shouts to you for spotlight, top, and bottom path because I have one. I have to pick which one I think oh, is the numbers. best. And to me, I think the top path is going to be better. Let's go over... Do the base base the base, 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 base upgrades first. Very simple. She shoots lasers out of her eyes like that. Effective move. You can hold as long as you want. She moves slower when she's doing it. My future is looking bright. Mm-hmm. Second thing she can do is throw out rings. You can damage enemies. You can also kind of push them around. Do so you can push them around. I don't know if you push them into. Let me push them into this. Okay, I did not know that. You can push them in the enemy, and we'll do damage. Probably the worst attack ever in Skyline history if you tried doing this every time because <laughs> it's hard to do. Why did I waste time telling you that? I don't know. Then the I beams do more damage as the third base upgrade. The fourth one, you finally get to use your third attack, and it looks like this. It's really cool. I like the animation of her wings when she does it. See that? Very cool. And I think you can have one, two, three, four, four going at one time. You already said that. Third thing hit enemies with halo rings, slows them down. That's what you saw. That right there. See how it's on top of the enemy? Once it does that, it will slow them down a bit. And the last base upgrade is you can have more Halo rings active at once. I think. Let's go over here. I think you could have three to start with. All right, never mind. I guess you could have two to start with, but now you can have it. Okay, I'm confused. Four? Yeah. So it goes from three to four. Now, My future is let me look bright. at the bottom upgrades really quick. So in case you think you like it, much to do with the rings. The first thing is Halo rings are larger and do more damage. Like I said, if you want to see this path, I recommend One of Wisdom search, and you'll find both paths on his channel. Halo rings shoot light beams of their own. I thought this would be a lot cooler than it is. If this was better, I might have done this path. But what happens is, you lay a ring out uh, like this. And it will shoot light beams intermittently. Inter. Why did you even attempt to say that word? 
intermittently. There it is. Over, 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 over. As long as they're out there. The thing is, you see how this is a constant beam? So there's a constant beam going out of the ring? That's what I thought it would be. It's not a constant beam. It's like a little blip of light. And it doesn't hone in on enemies. It's random. So it's very hard to hit the enemy with it. It's more of a defensive thing. Numbers. So basically what I'm saying is it's not that effective. I thought it would be better than it is. And this looks really cool. You can lift enemies caught in halo rings with the heavenly aura. It looks really cool. And that probably is the best move from the bottom path. So let's get past the base upgrades and level spotlight up. We're choosing visionary upgrade? improve eye beam attacks because I think they're better. And you can just spam them. Shoot a heavenly aura with eye beams to power it up and do more damage. So let's take a look really quick. 24. Oh, you're not even shooting. 24 and 46. Remember those numbers. Magical upgrade? Yes. Full bloom. Full bloom? That's a funny thing to say. So that's still those 24. Is that doing Hold on. Let me come out here. Okay, I can definitely tell that skin card. Let me do it. You can, let me see. Yeah, see the 97, 46, 97, so it does more damage. So you're doing damage with her again. beams so and the Heavenly even Aura is also and doing damage. I beams do even more damage and have longer range. So 46. Any place that you go, I can reach and bring you the magical upgrades. I hear Persephone is not going to be back in the next game. That's sad because I like Persephone better than the uh, the Rhino guy in Swap Force. So I went up from haha -ha, and told myself to remember is, was it 27? 46. But it's now 65 and you can just push it as long as you upgrade? wish. Shoot to the halo. Shoot two halo rings at once Boom. not the greatest upgrade to tell you the truth i don't know what advantage of having shooting two out at once does so you can kind of shoot it out and then if you do it correctly there you go kind of make a a barrier with the Light beams. Her soul gem Hello, is really again. nice. So happy Shoot heavenly aura with, with eye beams to create light dragons to attack enemies. I wish it sent out more, but I believe they'll shoot out around four dragons. Alright, right, they just went. They did 108 damage. Let me. See him? Now you can see him. So you can do crazy amounts of damage if you put the that on him, do this, and the dragons go. So in this pass, it's pretty simple, but very, very effective. Let's get up here. Too bad she couldn't fly, but that's probably because there's holes in her wings. She's very, very good. I'm going to play with her a lot when I finish up Superchargers. Let's see. Takes no time. Takes them out. That's the path I think is best. Please let me know below which path you chose. And if you disagree with me, have a great day. We'll see you in the next Path Guide video tomorrow. Adios. 
Light it up into the light. <laughs> 